Hello, everybody. We are back here on the Hunter Call of the Wild with, uh, Brobra in the closet. Let's close that. All right. Now he has to come out at some point. But anyway, we are here back on the Hunter Call of the Wild, and, uh, we're going to do, uh, another episode of the challenge series today. Today, we're going to do the in-game challenges, which you guys really liked it last time we did this. So, essentially, we're just going to start competitions. And first to win three of five competitions will be the uh, victorious one here. So, like I said, we're going to do a total of five challenges. First to win three ends up winning overall. Should be quite a bit of fun. So, uh, let's get into it. Uh, oh, my gosh. He's out. How's it going? All right. Let's start the first challenge. Let's see. Let's do... Let, let's start out small. This will be an easy one. The first to two challenge. This is just harvest two animals. Whoever harvests two animals will win. Now, the, the catch with this episode is that we have to use shotguns, so that's going to make things a lot more interesting. So we will see how this goes. Brober Frat traveled to tent. What is he? Oh. I'm going. Oh, uh, but, but we're supposed to start from here and just go off in different oh, directions. Okay. <laughs> Get back over here. You know, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start without you being over here. That's 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 your uh, that's your penalty for oh, di for disobeying the rules. I forgot the rules. Oh, I always forget the rules. It's fine. It's fine. It's I, fine. It's fine. I, I'm so good at this game. I can. I can. Don't worry. We're fine. We're fine. Everybody. I believe fine. in you. Although the game's taking forever to load down. Oh, no. <laughs> oh man. Right. And I've got some whitetail up here. You got nothing. <laughs> Probably not anytime soon. Shotguns are going to make this very tough. Because I didn't bring the shotgun scope. I just have the red raptor on me. Ooh, yeah, that's tough. I did. Um, I, I kind of want the three shotgun loadout. So I've got the uh, one of the over and unders that has the slugs. And then nice. I've got, which I've never used the over and under, so this could be a little tricky for me. And then the second cool. over and under, I've got the buckshot. Ooh, got a fox over here. Um, get the buckshot out. Oh no, it wasn't loaded in. I could have had that fox. Oh no, <laughs> it wasn't loaded in. Um, uh, I've got buckshot in the second over and under, and then I've got. Uh, the bird shot and the 12 gauge. Oh my gosh, pheasants everywhere! Oh no, 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 There we go. You didn't get two, did you? I don't know, did I? Oh, <laughs> man. I don't know, did uh, I? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, Fire that up. was the biggest, the like, one. panic trying to, like, switch ammo and waiting for it to reload. Because when you switch ammo, it, it has to reload in. So yeah, I had to wait for it to finish reloading. Wow, that was something else. <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh, there's more pheasants around here. All right, so what we're going to do now is uh, head over to a different outpost and start the next challenge from there. That way we don't know any of the animals that are in the area. All right, so for challenge number two, I think what we're going to do is go through here. I mean, since we're using a shotgun, might as well do the shotgun master challenge, which is harvest three animals using a shotgun. I mean, we're going to be doing that anyway, so we might as well go for it. So uh, let's go ahead and start running in opposite directions and chase after whatever we can find, this time at a different area as we have moved since the last one. Now, uh, let's get to it. Oh, we got a pheasant. I got pheasant over here too. This area is loaded with pheasants. I love it. Oh man, I just hear you blast. <laughs> I don't know if I hit it. <laughs> it was really far away when I took that shot. I have no idea if that impacted him. I'm just hoping like a white tail. Oh, I got him. <laughs> One of them down. Holy. Well. Okay. Maybe I guess I got him. You better get to blasting. I got the first one right here. Boom. Small pheasant. You know, if I just keep chasing the pheasants, eventually I'm going to run into them. Yeah, that's what you think. But these upland birds, they can be tricky. Oh, yeah. There's a fox in front of me somewhere. Oh, I see it. I see it. That was the weirdest sounding shot. I think my shotguns are like incredibly bugged. 
It's only loading one shell into them for the over and unders. Like, it's loading one shell in. But is it saying two? No, no, no. It's loading. Well, I don't know. I didn't look. But it's loading one shell in. I fire, and then it reloads. And then it's fine after that. I don't know what is going on with my game, but it's not its not working how it should be. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my gosh. It's some weirdo multiplayer things. That moose didn't even react like I hit it. Okay. Whoa, it shot one that time. What is happening? Okay. My, I mean, I'm loading okay. My animations are fine. Yeah, I mean, now I'm fine. That was so weird. Just I, little, I don't even know what to think. Just a little little weirdness. That's all right. A little bit of typical multiplayer. It's all right. We, we can get by with a little weirdness. Oh, oh yeah, definitely. I mean, I finally killed that fox after like 10 million years of tracking. And I, I just had to get it into an area that was rocky so that I could actually catch up to it. And take it out with the, uh, with the buckshot there. Yeah, I tried a, a couple. I tried putting some slugs into some moose over here. No, I didn't get a single one with those slugs. Jeez. I hit them. I hit them, but they were pretty far away when I took a shot. Yeah, I got I moose think. right here. If you've got them within like under 100 meters, you're probably good, but um, I have 150. It's like 150 for me. I, I did not get penetration. I hit dead on. Uh, and uh did not get long there's also teal above me i would i would try for the teal to be honest that's Even with that's your my thought too okay. oh it didn't die from it but i hit it at like 80 meters good luck neither of my moves <gasps> oh died. i killed it <laughs> Oh no. I killed it. Oh my gosh. And I found a whitetail zone with 10 whitetail in it. Holy. <laughs> what the? Come on. There's got to be something else in here. You got a little bit of time left because I got to track this thing. I, I hit it from pretty far away and it didn't die immediately. It kept going. Oh no, no, no. So I got to go <laughs> figure out where it is. It can't be the, the diamond whitetail all situation all over again where I just, I'm rushing so I, to complete one of these challenges and I botch a diamond. What's. Is it worth winning the challenge? I think it might be. I mean, oh, it's think, it's it's always worth it. I mean, unless it's a raccoon, a pheasant, a quail. I'll, I'll spot those. Ah, uh, but tail. don't you worry. We've got a ducky right here. No, Boom! No. Green wing teal. No. I'm, I'm coming back, finally. No. <laughs> uh, I, you know, after the... Who did you win last time? I don't remember who won the Mississippi one. I don't either. It might have been me, but I can't remember. Uh, but no I, I got to get back at you for the uh, 1v1 on Rancho where you demolished me. Like, oh, absolutely yeah. just destroyed me. <laughs> that was good. That was a good good match for me. That's for sure. All right. So we have moved down to this outpost clear down here. And also, I think I forgot to mention uh, before last challenge, uh, I did end up going to the three shotgun loadout just like Brobra because... One shotgun wasn't cutting it. Having to reload if every time I switch ammo just was not going to help us at all. But anyway, we moved down to this one, and we're going to go ahead and pick the next challenge. What should we end up doing? You know what? I think we should do the gold challenge. Harvest an animal with a gold score or higher. Let's go ahead and do that. The gold challenge has been started. Let's see who wins this on three. One, two, three. Three. This is a weird outpost. It is a weird outpost, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll go. I'll go west. Yeah, I'm just gonna head straight north. Come on. Oh, what did you? What? What are you shooting? Blasting at some random ducks flying, uh, flying along here. Yeah. <laughs> See, my thought is, I'm heading north, right? I'm heading up into the mountains. Maybe I can catch some uh, ducks that are flying super low. I'm going to try to go, like, west, down off the mountain, down into the lowlands to see if I can get, um, catch, uh, some whitetail moving around between zones or, um, catch some turkeys, uh, flying yeah. around. Well, I hate to break zones. it to you. I got raccoon calls. Oh, no. And they're really easy to chase. <laughs> yes, raccoons are. 
I love I love uh, raccoon hunting with shotguns. Yeah, it's, I'm gonna go run up to him with the buckshot and just see what happens. I oh, what... duck down! Now I just gotta hope it's not a gold. I don't know what it's gonna be. We got a duck down though. Maybe more than one. I think it was just one though. Yeah, they fly really low in this area. Lucky for you. Golds are not the easiest thing to get from most of the newer duck species. So as long as it's not mm. mallards, then you're good. I got a male raccoon call. Oh, yeah, that's right. We got to get vitals on anything yep. that we get because it's the gold challenge. Yep. That's why raccoons, even though they're easy to hit with the buckshot, it might be a little bit hard to get that to get a vital on them with the buckshot. Yeah, shot. for sure. Unless you're just like gunning them down from point blank. Like oh, this. this could be it. This could be it. I got a level six heavyweight estimate black bear. This mm, can make know. gold. Level six black bear, maybe. Yeah, the level six that has the up to 227 kg weight estimate, they can make gold. Okay. Uh, decently I mean, be, often as well. You've been grinding them, so you would know better than me. Yeah, they, I think probably half the time when they have this estimate and it's a level six, they'll make gold. Maybe a little bit less than half the time, but you know what I mean. It's it's a decently good chance that this thing could make it. Now, the question is, can I get it to stop fleeing <laughs> and get a good uh, angle? Yeah, and that's the other thing. Is you're going to have to get a good angle with the slugs on a black bear. Yeah, like birds are the easy win here, so are rabbits. Uh, everything else, it's going to be tough. Of course, the, the moose that are giving me a good shot are all level threes. <laughs> Sounds about right. It'd be kind of cool, like, if they did... Um, I can bring this up later, too, if we... In, like, another Uncut Hunts episode, too, but, like, um, small populations on maps, like we talked about last time, if they put, like, a little... Uh, like, um, you know, we'll just use um, SRP. Like, if they put um, coyotes on SRP, like, if there was, like, one, like, little, like, bird type, you know, that was kind of unique to that map. You know, oh, so yeah, that'd really, be cool. Like, a really small coyote population, but they have, like, um... Uh, oh, yes, it's a gold! No! <laughs> oh, my gosh, I got bear? a little... No, I killed a cottontail, and it made gold. No! <laughs> 174. It Let's go. Oh. <laughs> well, that's the quick victory. Yep, there you go. We might, we might have enough time to get another episode ready. <laughs> All right. Oh, we're doing, uh, was that first of three? Or we're doing first of five. No, it's like five in total. Whoever wins, uh, whoever's the first to getting three out of the five won. Oh, no. Yeah, that, that's, 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 that's why I said it was the, the, the quickest victory ever. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, yeah there's, there's something, something buggy about this shotgun. Like, it, it's only, I think it's whenever I take it out and put it back away. I know what it is. What? Because the game's having that bug where it's like registering the two shotguns as the same. If I shoot one from one and then I go to the other one, even if it says it has two, it shoots once and then does an extra fast reload because it thinks that it only has one in there because I shot the other over and under shotgun. Yep. I just tested that. Yep. Some Wow, that's crazy. What a bug. Well, everybody, that is going to be it for this episode. Hope you all enjoyed episode, I believe, three of the challenge series. It's been a while since we did episode two, so we figured it was time to jump back into it. And what better way to do it than uh, shotgun style on the New England mountains? As always, thank you, Brober, for stopping in and being a part of this. Always a pleasure, even though I got absolutely obliterated in this challenge. Just a little bit of payback for episode one. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace!